The 4th of July is right around the corner. That means fireworks will be seen across the country. But here in Massachusetts, people who plan to use fireworks must have a certificate of competency to work lawfully for professional fireworks displays. 22 News reporter Kiara Smith is working for you with the consequences of behind the illegal use of fireworks. The 4th of July is now four days away, and Americans will be gathering with family and friends to celebrate. A major part of these celebrations include fireworks, and while it may be a beautiful sight, they can be dangerous. This is why all types of fireworks, including sparklers, firecrackers, and cherry bombs, are illegal in the state. Monique from West Springfield says fireworks have become an issue in her neighborhood. What it does is it, it sprays all sorts of fireworks debris all over the street and in people's neighborhoods and in their backyards. So um, what that does is it can cause fires, it can set your lawn on fire, it can set the house on fire. So it can be very dangerous, not to mention it's... Uh, they could get hurt themselves. The Massachusetts Department of Fire Services reports that there have been more than 500 fires and explosives caused by the illegal use of fireworks in the state. And since 2019, fireworks have caused more than 200 injuries and $1.5 million in property damage. Lieutenant Tony Spear with the West Springfield Fire Department told 22 News about some of those personal injuries that can come with fireworks. The first thing that I think a lot of people think of our personal injury um, as far as the heat, the explosions, things like that, obviously you can lose fingers or hands um, if you're not careful and you're using these, again, illegally. Fines are up to $1,000 if you are caught using fireworks, so you may want to leave it to the professionals. You can go see fireworks at Six Flags in Aguam and at Star Spangled Springfield at Riverfront Park from 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. on the 4th of July. Working for you, Kiara Smith, 22 News. And as Kiara mentioned, Star Spangled Springfield is taking place this 4th of July, and the city of Springfield has issued a travel advisory in preparation for the fireworks display. Starting July 3rd at 11 p.m., Memorial Bridge will close to all traffic. On July 4th, exits 5A and 5B on I-91 South and exit 5 on I-91 North will close around 7 p.m. And streets in the area of Memorial Bridge will also be closed starting around 7.30 p.m. Memorial Bridge will reopen around 11 p.m. on the night of July 4th.